to me, the big story for many of us this week was inflation. You don't see it in interest rates. You do see, as I said last week, indication in the long bond market that inflation is kicking up. Um, you absolutely see it in the food prices and the, and the cost of day-to-day life. Um, it's, uh, it's very significant. And if you look at what's going on with quantitative easing around the globe by the central banks and the currency wars, um, that is intense. Tremendous gapping in pricing, unexpected and very dramatic switches. Welcome to the Solari Report. I'm Catherine Austin Fitz, and I'm delighted you could join me this evening. Our theme tonight is a long one. We are calling it Dow Jones Index Up, Popsicle Index Down, Congress and White House Tap Dance and Terrorize. The inspiration was several. We're seeing the stock markets rise. Um, and yet the uh, well-being of most people is falling globally. Uh, you certainly feel it when you look at the food prices. You know me. I'm always, uh, ex- I'm always pleading with everyone to eat lots of fresh food, but even I was stunned this week to see what the price was at the grocery store. So we have this non-alignment between financial equity and human equity, and we're feeling the pain of it as the slow burn gets worse. At the same time, we see real effort by the White House and Congress as they uh, debate how to re-engineer the federal budget, really trying to scare people over the sequester and the debt limit. Um, And, of course, they're having great difficulty dealing with the fundamental er efforts, with the issues of how do we re-engineer the economy in a way that align the Dow Jones and the Popsicle Index and start to build real wealth. (laughs) 